When banks make loans, it actually increases the money supply. How does that work? Well, the money supply is the total amount of money available in the economy at any time. Suppose a bank has $10,000 in deposits, and it lends out $9,000. That loan initially increases the money supply by $9,000. Now, if that $9,000 is deposited in another bank, and that bank keeps 10% in reserve, $8,100 could be loaned out. Repeating that cycle over and over again until there's nothing more to lend, it turns out that the original $9,000 loan can increase the money supply by a whopping $90,000. That's how money is created. The opposite is true, too. When people repay the loans, it shrinks the money supply. Here, when the first $9,000 is paid off, it reduces the money supply by $9,000. However, the bank will be quick to relend that money and return the money supply to its original size. In effect, money is being constantly created and destroyed and created again through banks' loan-making practices.